Welcome back, everybody. Chef Paulette does pasta right. She's making spaghetti fours in our super home surplus kitchen. She's giving it a little fun twist with lemons. Yes, Ooh, I this like is a, this idea. I totally love this mm -hmm. recipe. I think uh, it's probably inspired by the Amalfi Coast where they have lemons that are like this big. Yes. Mm -hmm. In fact, when I was over there, I actually stuck a couple of those in my suitcase. <laughs> they're, they're amazing. I mean, the skin is this thick, so the pulp is in the middle, but they're like oh. this. I'm not, I'm not exaggerating. This big. Oh, Huge. I love it. Okay. I love the smell of anything lemon. We were talking yeah. about how it's really healthy and it's great for you first thing in the morning yes. in a little hot water. Lemon juice, you know, lemon is just a good thing to eat, but it's also a tasty thing to eat, which is it. wonderful. So this recipe is so easy. You boil your pasta, and while it's boiling, you start putting your, your sauce together. Okay. You're not cooking this sauce. This is a no-cook sauce. Love oh, it. Okay. Which makes it really easy on a summer day. Mm. Yes. Just when you don't want to make the completely. kitchen super hot. Yeah. All you have to do okay. is zest um, some lemons. I have a bunch of lemon zest here, so you can just put that right okay. in that bowl. Okay, going to do that. Um, and, you know, it's easy to zest. I use this. You can use a, even a box oh, grater or something. And but you just want to get the yellow part you know you don't want the white part because that's a little bitter so um, the recipe says to use minced garlic but okay. I'm using some minced shallot today okay it's just a little bit lighter and right. so I'm gonna put that right in and then the shallot doesn't have the bite of like onion the, onion yes oh, shallots nice. are like a very um, light onion exactly now, is this uh, extra virgin olive oil that we're yes, putting into extra okay. virgin olive oil I put that in already and a Got little it. bit of salt now we have some minced um, uh, Italian parsley, which is the flat leaf parsley. It was funny. I saw this <laughs> earlier and I said, now what is that? She said, it's Italian parsley. And I said, yeah, I accidentally got that once when I was trying to get cilantro. Yeah, Because so they different. look very similar. But if that you went the other right. way around, it wouldn't even be worse. Yeah, yeah. If you put cilantro yeah. in here, you'd go like, what yeah. is that? Italian parsley. Okay, got okay. it. Okay, more you lemon juice? It? Yeah, we're putting okay. all this lemon juice in there. Ooh. That's our dressing. I mean, that's the whole thing. We're going to put a little cheese once we get nice. the pasta in and oh, some salt. Okay. And some pepper. Look how easy just dust a little pepper together. in there. Right. Okay, this so now great. I'm going to grab okay, the pasta. Okay, do it. Okay, now I like this pepper. might be a little messy. Yeah. You might need some of the pasta water. This is one of those recipes where the pasta water can be a ingredient. Oh. Because it's salty and yes. starchy from the spaghetti. Mm -hmm. And I'll just leave those over there. Love it. And um, it adds moisture to the dish. So then you just toss this, okay? Oh, look how pretty! And We're it's gonna have so to put pretty. Some cheese now, if you wanted to, oh, yeah. you could you want add, to sprinkle the cheese. Yeah, you could do a little chicken on this if you wanted. You could do shrimp. You could Ooh, shrimp. You could. Good. And you yeah. know, actually, there's another recipe where you can put a can of tuna in, which oh, really? sounds like oh. kind of crazy, but it's really, really goes well with this. Um, oh, look at that! So I'm just gonna add some olive oil because you want to get that nice sheen and you want to have that flavor of the olive oil too. It looks like there's a lot going in. But <laughs> I was like, Chef Paul. <laughs> <laughs> she needs to get a bigger dress. People, you know what? <laughs> Look at her skin, and you know why you need to eat more But you know, olive oil, olive oil yeah. if you skin. use it as a condiment and not as something you're frying in, it's not really that fatty thing. It's, oh. it's and something else. And you shouldn't use it as a frying oil, right? Well, I do. Because it's, I do. A, it's got like a... Well, you don't want to use the really special ones that you get that you spend a lot of money on. Right. But the yeah. kind oh, that gotcha. you can, you know, um, like a, you can find a more inexpensive one more to cheese. use at all. We love I'm mansion. looking at this stuff. <laughs> it needs more. It needs more. It's one of those dishes where, okay, put some more Taste lemon juice. It. Put some Look, more. We're ready. We're you like, know, you've okay, got okay, the tongs. Ready, girl. Yeah, yeah. Here, let Let's me serve have it. it. We're, we're going to do serve this. You. I just, the, the smell of the lemon, it just looks beautiful. It smells beautiful. This recipe is going to be on todayinnashville.com. Everybody, you can check it out. Got four. Also, so you are still doing cooking classes, yes? Yes, I'm doing cooking classes. That. We do all authentic Italian recipes, a lot of them that I bring back from Italy because I study with a lot of home cooks there. Mm. And so that information is like on my Chef Paulette Facebook page or on chefpaulette.net. I was going to say, and how can people find you? Yeah, that's, so that's basically the, the right way. And then I also have my cookbook, which came out just a few mm. months ago, um, Italian Cooking Party. I uh, love that. It's how to do your own Italian cooking party at your house. I love this. Yum. Is it good? Chef Paulette, this is amazing. I'm so really glad. Good. I love it. Thanks for being here. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is fun.